Yo, what's going on YouTube? It's me, The Incredible Greek, and welcome to another video. So, we've got a video from Brave Wilderness. Yeah, he's a guy that likes to get himself bitten by all sorts of, like, vicious, like, you know, creatures from the world, from the wild. And we're about to see a video of him getting bitten by a snapping turtle. Now, he's done the alligator snapping turtle, which has lost a like, huge mother foe that will literally bite your bloody hand, like, bite your hand off, okay? It's like a giant vice, but it's just a math, like, vice. But he's, I think he's downscaling it to uh, just a snapping turtle, but... I would not want to get bitten by that either, okay? I had terrapins when I was little, right? They were about this big, and I got my finger bit, okay? My finger was bitten by one of these things, and it hurt like a motherfucker. And, <laughs> and this is like, this is going to be from a turtle, I don't know, at least this big, I think. At least this big, I think. This guy's mental! This guy is absolutely mental! But he's one brave, brave, brave motherfucker. But uh, I've seen this. I've seen a whole bunch of videos from this guy, and he is awesome. His his videos are absolutely awesome. If you're looking for a little bit of a thrill, something to get your heart beating a little bit faster, then I would subscribe to Wild uh, Brave Wildness uh, Wilderness. Excuse me, Brave Wilderness, and. Uh, Check out that channel because if you're looking for stuff, stuff, stuff like this, and you like this sort of stuff, mate, go and subscribe to this channel because it is good. So I uh, give this guy massive props for having the biggest balls in the world, you know. <laughs> but anyway, let's check this out. <sighs> Bitten by a snapping turtle. Let's check it out. Right here we go. One, two, three, go. Social media. I recently asked the Coyote Pack, "Would you like to see me chomped by a common snapping turtle?" That hurt, but it didn't draw blood. I wonder what a larger turtle would do. You guys want to see me chopped by the common snapping turtle? Well, a whopping 95% of you said yes. Of course we're going to say, oh shit! So no. today I'm going to do just that and demonstrate what happens if you ever get your hand locked in the jaws of a snapping turtle. Now, I know you're watching this video and you're thinking, Coyote, this is absolutely crazy. Of this course! It's going to bite off your finger, it's going to bite off your hand, it's going to cause so much damage, you'll have is. to go to the hospital. It is! We have thought about this in advance, and we actually have some safety precautions in place to make sure that that turtle does not take a chunk out of my hand. We purchased these dowel rods. What I'm going to do is cut a section of the wood and then glue it to the side of my hand so that when the turtle bites down, my hand will be sideways and it's going to strike out whap and latch on now the beak is going to pierce the top and the bottom side of my hand uh. what I'm really worried about is the scissor power of those jaws and that's why a snapping turtle bite can be so bad their jaws are razor sharp lined with that beak as they bite down the beak cuts through the skin now what the wood will do is create a my, barrier that's... between the turtle's beak and its ability to scissor all the way through my hand and take out a triangle shaped chunk. I know you're probably thinking to yourselves, well, it's still gonna bite you, it's still gonna hurt. Exactly. Yes, it absolutely is. And hopefully the turtle holds on the first time so I don't have to be bitten more than once. Now, once the turtle bites me, I will show you how to get a snapping turtle off. And there are a couple of methods you can use. The what? first one, is water bottles. Water Simply bottles. dumping water onto the turtle's face, in its mouth, and on its eyes should make it feel as if it's back into its natural environment, which would be the water, uh -huh. and it will let go and try to get away. I don't think it's going to be that simple. If the water bottle method doesn't work, what you can do is completely submerge the turtle in water. If this does not work, the last resort is rubbing alcohol. Now, this alcohol? Is something that I've seen a number of different people try use when they've been bitten by snakes or alcohol. Alcohol? You're going to try to get the turtle pissed? <laughs> Mate, that thin piece of... You saw how thin that piece of wood is. I don't think that wood is going to do anything. I, what if it bites through the wood? These things are powerful. They've got powerful jaws, man. Alligators, and it's not going to hurt the animal in any way, but it's just kind of a sharp, pungent taste in its mouth, and it should force it to... Ah, let go of my hand, and then hopefully... <laughs> I'll be able to show you guys how to take care of that bite with some first date. And if none of those work, you just have to wait. Yes, that is the worst case scenario. If it doesn't let go from one of these methods, I will have to sit there, bite my tongue in pain, 
and hope that eventually this turtle loses interest in my hand from being angry at me for letting it bite my hand and that it lets go. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, boy. We are... Oh, so this! We've been chomped by the common snapping turtle. Mate, my heart is going. I'm definitely nervous right now. This is going to hurt. I'm nervous for you. Just imagine that beak piercing through Get your skin. hand away! And if it bites and it holds on, whoo, it is going to be incredibly painful. That's not a small turtle. It's about 10 pounds in size. And it ah! crunch my hand. Oh Ooh. my goodness! Okay, okay, okay. I'm fucking trembling a now little bit. Look at the common snapping turtle. Look at the size of it! Isn't super rare, but oftentimes I catch turtles that are significantly larger than this. A turtle larger than this would definitely do a massive amount of damage to my hand. Camera two, oh camera my three god, he's pissed, rolling. he's pissed, bro. Is he's pissed. This is crazy. This is crazy. He's pissed. This is crazy. Oh my goodness, you're actually doing this. Yeah, well, let's see what happens, right? I'm Coyote Peterson, and I'm about to enter the chomp zone with the common snapping turtle. Are you ready? No, I'm not. One. Two. No! Three. Ah! Ah, he missed the wood. He missed the wood. And he's latched onto my hand. You alright? Ah! Ah! Oh, he's ripping the side of my hand. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm not gonna touch the turtle. He missed the wood. This is bad. He is. Ah! Oh, Mario, shit! Now you can see the turtle beak has pierced through the top of my hand, and it is latched. Oh, yeah, he's missed that. His jaws locked in place. Just lightly trip that onto the top of his head. Ah, 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 ah. He's biting down harder. He's biting ah, harder. Ah, That's not working. That's not working. It's not working. It's not working. It's making him bite harder. To lift him up and get him into the water is going to be extremely Mate, painful. my heart is going a mile a minute. Straight to, the, straight to the rubbing alcohol. Now you can see right, they're gonna try and get him drunk. <laughs> into my hand. The beak has pierced through the skin. Oh my gosh, that hurts so bad. You ready? He's got the back side of my hand. Yep, go ahead. Just kind of dump some into his into his mouth. Yeah, go on, mate. Have a drink. Let go. Okay. Oh no, it's yanking. Uh, oh. oh. Wow, he cut major holes in my hand. Okay, let me dip him in the water to get that rubbing alcohol off. There you go, little buddy. Oh my god. <laughs> ah! <laughs> there you go, little buddy. Thanks for biting my head off. <laughs> Jesus. Okay. Yeah. Ah, jeez. Oh man, he bit right there and slid off to the I'm side. I'm surprised. I'm surprised there's no ah! blood. Oh, that hurt. Ah, hold on a second. It's almost like his mouth wasn't big enough to reach around and bite onto me. Mate. Ah. Okay, I'm gonna just get this piece of wood off. Ah. Ah. There's the bite right there, you see that? Ooh. Oh my god. Ah. Wow. That is one ah. big love well, bite, mate. The water actually just caused the turtle to bite down harder. Mate. We got the rubbing alcohol into its mouth that it actually would let go. Now you can see where the jaws scissored through my skin. Wow, and the crushing power was insane. <laughs> I honestly thought the water was going to work, and I thought I'd be able to get it back into that container of water. To it doesn't look it as bad now, now that it's... Only in an emergency situation where you didn't have rubbing alcohol would you want to do that. Did the dowel rod... Dowel rod was ineffective. It Still, that must be so painful. <laughs> it missed the dowel rod. It bit it to the side. The... I mean, I guess that's one thing you can't anticipate exactly where a turtle's going to bite. <laughs> He missed the wood. Uh, let's bring the turtle back up. Make sure he's okay. My. Here, buddy. Oh! Okay, yeah, he's like, let's go again. Let me hold him up kind of like that. Ran this. two, motherfucker. Ran two. Well, that was actually a pretty quick chomp and release. Um, I thought I was going to be able to take that pain a little longer than that, guys. But having the turtle locked onto my hand was... Whew, that was intense. No. Just imagine what a turtle that weighs 40 or 50 pounds could do. Definitely would break your hand, if not take off your fingers. Yeah. I'm Coyote Peterson. Be brave. Stay wild. We'll see you on the next <laughs> adventure. 
I know you were all thinking, Coyote, getting bitten by a snapping turtle was totally crazy. I agree, and trust me, it really hurt. Ah. Uh. He, he missed the word. <laughs> Being chomped by what I consider to be a small turtle will serve as a warning to everyone out there watching. Yeah. Snapping turtles have the potential to be incredibly dangerous. Do not try to catch them. Do yes. not try to pick them up. Yes. In fact, uh, if you come across one of these turtles in the wild, fuck away from simply one. admire it from a safe distance. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Unless the animal is provoked, there is absolutely no chance you will end up taking a chomp. If you thought being chomped by this turtle looked painful, make sure to go back and watch the time. Yeah, that video. Go check that that video. Alligator snapping turtle. And don't forget, subscribe so you can join me and the crew on this season of Dragon Tales. He slipped in between the bamboo and went into my arm. Screw that, mate. So yeah, he done he done the snapping turtle, which is like considerably larger than the turtle that we just saw. The bite of the snapping turtle is so dangerous that he had to literally bandage his entire arm here to like minimize the bite. If he'd done it raw. If he'd done it purely raw, that snapping turtle would have potentially could have broken the bloody bone or just taken a whole chunk of flesh from his like forearm. Go check out that video; it's really good. There's loads of other videos that he's. he's that's what this is. What the channel is of him getting bitten and stung by loads of different animals, and it's oh dear. This guy has got major, major balls. He's got such big balls and uh, give him such respect for that. Such respect for our entertainment and our bloody, uh, yeah, our te yeah, teaching us about these animals and how dangerous they can be and how bad, you know, their uh, bites or stings can be. Uh, so, yeah, guys, if you, if you enjoyed this video, if you enjoyed what you saw from Brave Wilderness, Go and subscribe to his channel. He's got nearly six million subscribers. He's at five. He's at yeah. He's at uh, five million eight and a half thousand subscribers. But he really does deserve uh, those, those those subs because uh, the the production that goes into this video, you know, the work that goes into this video, and obviously the big coup de draw, the bite uh, that you want to see, that you've clicked on the video to see. This is the video. Uh, this is the channel that you'd wanna wanna subscribe to if you want. You know, I was saying earlier in the video that if you want a bit of a thrill, you know, you want a bit of excitement, <sighs> mate. Before he even got bit, my heart was going. My heart was. I was getting scared for the guy. I was getting nervous for this guy because I was worried for him. I was really, really worried for him, man. Jesus. <laughs> But anyway, guys, look, thanks very much for uh, st stopping by, checking out this video. I hope you guys enjoyed yourselves. And, uh, yeah, don't, don't forget to check out my other uh, material, my other content. And I'll see you guys later on the next video. The Greek is out. Bye.